from uh, good morning and thank you thank you all for participating and the, for the opportunity well i'm going to talk about the the access to culture for the people with disabilities and i'll start from take from the marrakesh treaty the marrakesh treaty is very closely linked to the un uh, convention for the people with disability for the promotion of the rights of people with disability and it was one of the greatest if not the greatest achievement of the outgoing DJ, actually his own words, that was the biggest uh, achievement that he achieved, he arrived at uh, throughout his mandate. And uh, although it was a great advancement, uh, it's still inco an incomplete one. It's an incomplete one for two reasons. Uh, for one of the reasons, um, it uh, cuts short on providing access to culture to people with visual uh, disabilities to other material, other, to material other than the text ones. So as for the Marrakesh Treaty, the people with visual disabilities only have access in accessible format uh, to text material. Uh, on the other hand, it also cuts short on, stops short of actually enabling access to culture and the full participation in the cultural life of people with other disabilities. So um, if we take the Marrakesh Treaty just by itself, in fact, although it promotes the inclusion of people with visual disabilities in, in terms of access to tax material, it excludes all other uh, people with disabilities of having the same and equivalent access, creating a distinction uh, within uh, the group of people with disabilities, all of which are not going to be uh, their desires and their wishes and their needs, their cultural needs are not going to be fulfilled by uh, the right holders for the same reasons why the people with visual disabilities were not, for lack of commercial interest. So uh, my proposal, very objectively, is to expand, to keep moving forward in terms of providing access to people with disabilities for which there is no, not really a market for them, uh, and expand them beyond the people with visual disability to people with other disability. And in that sense, really completing the job of uh, fulfilling and moving forward the UN Convention of the Rights of People with Disabilities. Uh, that proposal does fit the development agenda, does fit the line and the arguments that went through with the Marrakesh Treaty. So it's basically a follow-up from the Marrakesh Treaty. Thank you.